Okay, so if you saw my last video, you know the Mazda pickup with the Kia engine is now running. And uh, we're still working out a few bugs. And we're going to come out with a video on the wiring here. Once we get it all completely sorted and all tidied up, we still got wiring. Uh, just kind of strung out and we still need to uh, get the rest of it finished up. So that video is going to be coming. And uh, for right now, I don't have much to do. And so I'm going to uh, build a flatbed for this uh, little Mazda pickup. And it's uh, going to be a little bit different than standard flatbed because it's going to be a pop-up dovetail. I've been wanting to do this here for a long time. Uh, now's a good time that the pickup bed's already taken off. And so uh, we should be able to get this done up here hopefully fairly quick. Okay, here's what I've done so far. I uh, have this uh, channel iron. I have salvaged off of uh, some old uh, tractors. I used to have a tractor salvage. I, have a, I always kept good steel. And I have a bunch of this... Uh, not a bunch, but I have some of this box steel here, and it's uh, two and a half inch, and uh, I have some more that is uh inch and a half, and it's actually uh, remnants from the uh, high tunnels we built, and if you haven't seen those videos, uh, make sure you check those out. And here's the other side here, I uh, got this cut out for the uh, gas fuel spout. And uh, I haven't really filmed anything because it was just kind of a uh, busy work, just getting my metal all cleaned up. I had a bunch of junk on that uh, channel that had to be all cut off. And so uh, I just went ahead and got all that cut to length and all done up. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, start getting all this uh, cut up and start welding it all up. And uh, we'll see on how far I get here today. What down that boat? welded onto the uh, piece of box still here I'm using and it's something I didn't really uh, think of when I started this and I thought my box still would be wide enough to uh, clear the tire for when the wheel comes up with the suspension and I kind of find out the tire could possibly rub 
the box still by about like a half inch. So instead I'm going to have to uh, make some cuts and I'm going to try to move the bottom corner of the box still in and try to get it so the tire can clear it. Okay, got the uh, deck here completely done, and I still need to uh, put out my um, my uh, flat steel on top of it. But that's going to be done here after the dovetail is built, and I'm hoping to uh, get the start on the dovetail here in the next video. So uh, be sure you subscribe, and uh, be sure to like the video and leave a comment down below. There's uh, going to be quite a few more videos. Uh, about this uh, picket bed and uh, like I said earlier it's kind of a unique picket bed design I have uh, really never seen one like it and I'm hoping to uh, get it finished here fairly soon and uh, test it out and see how it does and I appreciate you watching